Hey you guys, it's Miss So Fabulous. So I'm here to do another Sephora gratis haul. And I have two full bags of stuff to show you guys. Because it is holiday time, we have been getting a lot more gratis. Once again, if you don't know what gratis is, gratis is a whole bunch of free stuff that we get from Sephora from the different brands um, that we sell in the store. So I'm just going to grab one bag and get started. So the first bag, what I have in here, and I have two of. So I got two of the Lancome Nude Miracle Foundations. This is one of Sephora's new um, foundations that they carry in the... Um, store and I'm actually wearing this one right here the reason why I got two when the brand ambassador first came I wasn't there so they picked a color for me and they thought I was this freaking dark so when I actually came back and she was there we decided it was this one but she ended up still giving me both so I'm gonna give this away to a friend and I am wearing this today absolutely beautiful look how flawless my skin is now this particular foundation is a lightweight sheer coverage this is for that person that does not need a lot of coverage at all this is a liquid to powder the great thing about this and she demonstrated on my face too and i hate when people demonstrate on my face but she demonstrated on my face you can actually use this on top of your makeup as well so this is really good if you have um, oily skin and you want to mattify your face you could just take this liquid and take a brush and go right over your face and it is not going to disturb the makeup that you already have on so absolutely love this so if you're wondering I am shade 550N the other shade that I got is 500W so this will be somebody that is a little bit warmer than me also which I've also used I got the bliss oh it's all yucky because my boyfriend used it yesterday I got the bliss multi-faced um, all-in-one anti-aging clay mask I actually used this a couple days ago absolutely love this product um, also Miss Posh here on YouTube uses this in her she uses this as well she showed it in her skincare routine so when I got it in my gratis I was actually excited to try it so far so good um, I love a mask that I can use when I wash off it doesn't leave my face feeling dry it felt my um, it left my face feeling super hydrating and super moisturized and I love the cooling sensation that it gives the tingling sensation that it gives to my face as well um, my boyfriend had just freshly shaved his face and then when he used it yesterday he said it it, like burned his skin but yeah don't use it before, after you shave or wax so yeah I also got this first aid beauty ultra repair cream and this is instant therapy skin protected um, so this is just a facial daily facial moisturizer from first aid beauty I also got the cute Look how cute this is. This is the holiday um, version of Tarte's eyelash curler. I hear a lot of good things about this on YouTube and I do use this while I'm at work as well. So I'm actually excited that I got one because I needed a new one. I also got a brush and I don't ever really I really get brushes in my Sephora gratis but I got this Sephora this is the pro full coverage airbrush foundation brush so this is an awesome it's a really dense compact brush it's shaped in a fan shape so you're able to cover um, more of your face in one so this is gonna give you that ultimate coverage that you're looking for for your full coverage foundations I also got another hair product. This is the BB Repair Blow Dry for dry and damaged hair cream. You apply this to your hair when you want to blow dry it. So I got this. I also got one of NARS's new powder foundation and the shade I got is Syracuse. Now normally I wear um, normally I wear Kadaz but in the new powder foundation line they don't carry the full range of colors but this color actually works well for me. This is an all day illuminous powder so this is going to give you that medium to full coverage. I'm not really a powder foundation kind of girl but I will use it to help set my makeup as well when I'm looking for those days where I need the extra coverage and as I stated before this particular foundation is lightweight very sheer I realized I realized while I was at work when I tried this on I was like 
I clearly don't need full coverage and I always use medium to full coverage foundations but my like you guys seen my skin before my skin is pretty clear for the most part I have a little bit of uh, discoloration in my cheek area but for the most part I really don't need coverage and for this to be a sheer lightweight foundation it looks full coverage on my particular face so I'm absolutely loving that and then also I got in here, I got this Hello Kitty Cobalt Blue Liquid Eyeliner from her set. I also got a Becca, ooh, I didn't even know this was in here. I got a Becca Shimmering Skin Protectant, and this is one of Becca's liquid, ooh, ooh, ooh. This is one of Becca's liquid, um, illuminizers for the face now you can use this alone and you can use this to mix in with your foundation the color I got is opal a lot of people have been using the powder opal here on YouTube that is like a big craze here on YouTube now so I got the liquid version of it I also got another first aid beauty this is an ultra therapy lip therapy and this is for dry lips so I believe this is like either treatment or just like a chapstick so it says use as needed and then I got the Urban Decay Holiday Set eye Eyeliners and I actually got end up getting two sets of these because we do have a lot of guys that work at my particular Sephora and they get the same things that we get but the guys don't wear makeup so they really don't need it so like he had gave me his so I have two sets of these and this is like I said the Urban Decay Holiday Set so it comes with your darker colors you get um you get zero, you get perversion, you get a charcoal gray, and then you get um, an eggplant purple, a turquoise. You just get some really nice colors in these. I also got a Dior, and this is the Dior Rouge Lip Balm. And this is a tinted lip balm in shade number 558. And it's a watermelon color. This is just a tinted lip balm really really nice I get so excited when I get Dior products because it makes me feel all hostility and whatnot I also got another Becca product this is the Becca beach tint so this in watermelon this is in shade watermelon so basically this is one of those multi-purpose um, um, products where you can use on your cheeks and you can use it on your lips and it's just going to you know tint your face to give you that really nice natural flush so I got that I also got a pair of small scissors which I need for my kit. I also got another like just a disposable, not a disposable but a spoolie to help groom my brows. And I also got, what are these? I got this Ula Hendrick Power Peel set so it comes with one step one step two step three so I got a sample of that the next product I got is a product from benefit and we didn't even know that we had this in the store one day we was walking by and we was like what the heck is this and this is a Becca perfume so Becca came out with a fragrance and it is called I can't even read this small behind bottle I don't know but it looks like this it comes in a rose gold uh, packaging and it smells phenomenal absolutely love the smell I'm really into like fruity scents and this is kind of like fruity and floral but it's a very light scent it is a body mist it's not a perfume it is a body mist um and it's a really light fragrance but the fragrance kind of reminds me of like okay this sounds disgusting but I still like it it reminds me of like bathroom air freshener kind of um if you ever go to Sephora try smelling this and see what you guys think of it and then, super excited, I also got another Alginus product, and this is the Alginus Genius Ultimate Ultimate Anti-Aging Eye Cream from Alginus. So I'm super excited about this because I really, really, really loved um, Alginus's brightening mask. So yeah, super excited to try this. Absolutely been loving eye creams and stuff like that, so definitely. So now moving on to the second bag. In this particular bag, I got a cute little Beauty C Plus bag. And inside here, it has two products. It comes with, oh, excellent. It comes with the Sephora Instant um, Facial Moisturizer. Absolutely love this stuff. I have, even though I have oily skin, when I wash my face, my face tends to feel really dry. And this really hydrates my face, so I'm excited to have that. And also in this pouch... 
It comes with a Sephora roll-on, um, instant depuff roll-on for your eyes. So this is excellent. I'm actually going to put this in my kit because I do have a lot of clients that have, you know, concerns with puffiness under the eyes and this will really help with their makeup application to go on way smoother if they look more awake. So I'm excited about that. So that was in that bag. I also got another First Aid Beauty and this is the First Aid Beauty Facial Cleanser. So this is a daily facial cleanser. Excited about that. The more, the more stuff I get, the better. The less I have to go to the store and buy cleansers and stuff, the better. I also got this Soap in Glory and this is the Firminator. And it says special, special bikini bottom formula proven to help visibly firm and turn firm tone and reduce the appearance of or orange peel skin so it says it's a peppermint i have no clue what this is for um the firminator special bikini bottom formula i will give you more information on what this particular product is but yeah I also got some Wen shampoo in the pomegranate scented one. Never tried Wen, but always hear good things. Always see the infomercials on TV. And then I'm really upset about this. I got this Marc Jacobs foundation and this is the Marvelous Mousse. Now I was really excited about getting this particular foundation but they got my shade wrong and I picked my shade out that day and I don't know how I still end up getting the wrong shade but the shade I got is 22 Bisque Light. So I'm just gonna throw this in my kit for some of my Caucasian women. I also got another First Aid Beauty. I've been getting a lot of First Aid Beauty stuff and normally I get a lot of Ren products. But I got this face, um, Facial Radiance Overnight Mask. So this is another overnight mask. I've gotten a lot of night treatments and stuff. So, But the really good thing about all these skincare products, I've been getting a lot of compliments on my skin lately. Like I, earlier this morning, I actually had a client that I completely forgot about. So I had to rush down to the shop in my pajamas and do her lashes. And I didn't have any makeup on and she was like, girl, that's all you. She was like, you have beautiful skin. And I was like, really? Thank you. So, yeah. I also got this Phyto Paris. And this is a, I believe this is just, what? This is for a lightweight hydrating oil for dry and fine hair. So this is a leave-in um, leave treatment for dry and fine hair. I thought that was for your face. And then I got this new Benefit, and this is the Majorette. It's a blush cream. So basically what it is, it looks like this. It's a coral cream blush, but you can use it as a base as well for your blushes so that you have the longevity of your blush to stay on your cheeks. So that is that. And there's a couple other things. Hold on one second. Then I got two of the Sephora fiber mask. This is um, the one in the pomegranate mask and this is for anti-fragile and energizing to give you more of an energized face. And this one is ultra moisturizing and brightening mask. So I got that. I also got a product from Ren and this is their flash rinse one minute facial so you apply this in the shower um, when you first get in the shower and then you rinse it off and this is a brightening mask that's going to help brighten and give your skin that um it says that vitamin c gives a spa facial it brightens firms and gives radiance breakthrough technology locks 10 percent of vitamin c and silica um in it so yeah and one use of this you don't need to use this every day i was using this daily because i end up getting two of these um you can't you don't have to use this daily at all like once a week is good enough for this particular product i got a pair of sephora brand lashes i also got the buxom the Buxom Mascara. So Buxom came out with their mascara and this one is Show Off Black. This is one of their um, most popular mascaras, but they created it with different um, mascara ones that you can choose from depending on what you want your lashes to do. So I got this one and this is the Big and Bushy, Super Bushy uh, Mascara. This is made to give you that ultra volume, big false eyelash look. So I got that. 
I also, I always get this in my gratis. I also got this Sephora X Formula Press Pods. And this is used for one application to paint your nails. I'm actually going to try one of these on painting my toes as well. I got another Peter Thomas Roth 40% Triple um, Acid Peel sample. I also got a sample of the Elizabeth and James Nirvana perfume. I got the Josie Marin Coconut Water Cheek Glaze. And the shade I got is Getaway Red. So this is just a cheek stain. Ooh, and I got another Sephora brush. Yes, keep bringing on these brushes like I need any more gosh darn brushes. But I got this Sephora brush right here and this is the Pro Flat Concealer Brush. I actually use this at Sephora to help sketch in arch people's brows. So I'm excited to have this for myself. I got a bracelet in here or a keychain. I got a Makeup Forever a makeup forever I think this is a keychain or a necklace or a bracelet this is a makeup forever bracelet really cute winding down to the last few bit of products I got this um, bare minerals 501 BB advanced performing cream eyeshadow and this eyeshadows in soft linen so this is probably one of those really nice just cream eyeshadows um, I might end up using this for a base for my colored eye shadows so excited about that. I also got a Sephora mini um, mascara in the Outrageous Curl formula. I also got this product from um, the No Makeup brand and they created the No Bleeding Lips but they came out with the No Dark Circle, the, the No Dark Circles, the No Dark Circles Concealer and this is supposed to be a universal um, concealer for all skin types to help brighten the appearance of dark circles under the eyes but I'll let you know how this works because you know for us women of color not everything that's called universal works for us so... And then I also got one of these little nail polish minis. These are just like glitters in here. And then the last but not least, I got a Sexy Mother Puckers lip gloss in the shade I got is Womp Pink. So the Sexy Mother Puckers, this is a lip plumping lip gloss and this is meant to make your lips really plump and juicy. I don't know how well it works but it is our number one selling lip plumper in Sephora so yeah I'm excited to have that as well. I might throw this in my kit because as you guys know I have full lips already I don't need. So I started um, you know purchasing eyeshadows from the new Makeup Forever Artistry line Artist Shadows. So I wanted to start my line because I did want to you know put together a palette for my kit and they had so many fabulous colors so I wanted to start off with the transition colors from that particular line hold on I just I used one so I had to flip it over um, so I started off with the transition colors so I will have a transition color for no matter you know what skin tone I'm working with so the first color I got is this one right here and this is number 536 I also got this one right here which is more of a reddish brown and this one is number 650. I got this one right here which is more of a deeper one that I'd use for myself and this is 660. And these are all matte transition shades. And then I got this one right here. This is for more of my chocolate women and this is number 636. So those are the shadows that I got for my transition. I'm missing some. So I thought, so this color is a nice strawberry raspberry color. Um, it reminded me of Jaclyn Hill. She uses a lot of um, redder undertone um, transition shades. And I thought this would be a great transition shade for when I'm using um, purples or I want to warm up a, you know, eyeshadow look or warm up a smoky eye. I thought this color would be great. And this shade is 820. And that is also a matte. And then I also got this really beautiful deep eggplant purple shade right here to also go with that transition shade to help smoke it out a bit when I'm doing my purples and pinks. And this is 928. And then just for fun, one of the fun, you know, sparkly shades that I got is this Makeup Forever one. And it is the teal blue. And this is 
236 and this is part of their diamond shadows line if you guys seen my real talk i was kidnapped video i was wearing this particular eyeshadow on my eyelids so yeah so i purchased all of those and i also purchased a becca powder foundation and um the darkest one, I forget what the name is, but I'm going to use that to help contour with some of my more deeper women of color. I always use that at Sephora as a contour um, powder for them, so I purchased that for my kit as well. And then I also purchased some NARS, um, some more NARS cream, um, how, what is this? The Radiant Creamy Concealer. I absolutely love this. So I got the color in Amande and the color in Caramel because most of my clientele are women of color. So I used the Amande for darker women of color and the Caramel for women um, my skin tone in a little bit deeper. So I got these. I am going to go back and purchase a couple more because I do want to get all of the colors for my kit. So, yeah, you guys. Um, also, oh, I forgot one more thing that I got in my gratis, and I got two of these also. This is another Alginus product. This is the Alginus Purifying and Replenishing Cleanser. This is a daily cleanser that you can use for your face. Once again, I did get two of these because one of the guys at Sephora didn't seem to need it, and I love facial cleansers. Like I said, the more facial cleansers I get, the less I'll have to buy them. So, super excited about this, and like I told you guys before, I really, really enjoyed the Alginus line, so... Woo! Yeah, you guys, that is it. I know this is going to be a super long video. I absolutely apologize. If you guys are wondering, I am wearing the Marc Jacobs Siren eyeshadows on my eyes. And I'm also wearing this Bite Cosmetics um, matte lipstick. And the shade this is in is Peachy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, remember to always rate, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, twitter.com backslash missilesofabulous TV. Facebook, facebook.com backslash missilesofabulous. And remember you guys, have a nice and wonderful day. Bye.